my friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today you are live from my uh, living room because I was super excited to open my owl crate box. It just came in the mail today, so I wanted to pop into it. Okay. So, my goal with the um, boxes is I want to get a new one. So a different box every month and kind of give them all a little test to see which one I want to subscribe to or if I like doing an assortment. Um, I did Owl Crate when they first came out a while ago now um, and I liked it so I thought it would be fun to bring that back. Um, I think, I'm trying to think of which one, I did subscribe to another one for next month already. Um, so that one, we'll see when that one comes. Here we go. Our little spoiler card. It's got some cute girl in outer space, but don't want to read it. Okay, so there's a look in the box. I'm going to put it down so we can see what's in here. Ooh, this is Until the Last Star in the Galaxy, You Have Me. Um, so it's a like a book tin. Um, that you can put things in. So that's super cute. This is so cute and I definitely am going to get use out of this. Um, the next thing is the bookish pins. And I do know that Bir er, Owl Crate does these every month. Honestly, I don't really know what it's for, but we'll figure it out from the spoiler card later. Um... The next thing, ooh, it looks like jewelry. Isn't this beautiful? Oh, look at how pretty that is. It is beautiful. It's um got like almost computer parts in there. I don't know if, how well you can see it, but it's so pretty. I definitely really like that. And then, ooh, we got some cute little magnets, uh, magnet bookmarks. Once again, I feel like I'm kind of at a loss. I fully know what this is from. They're cute. This guy with the horns is really neat. And then, oh, I hope you get this message. I've been wanting to read this one. This one's been on my TBR for a little while. Um... It sounds so cool. It's like the end of the world, and so I'm super excited to have this. Very cool. And I love these, like, two-toned book covers, this trend that's been going around. Um, there is a note from the author, so that's really cool. Very cool. I, is there a book? Oh, and then it is signed. So very cool. Oh, and look at the naked cover. That's awesome. Ones and zeros, what we're all made of, right? And back in here. Very neat. Okay, and then there is actually another book in here. And it is The Crier's War. Um, I feel like I just saw this like not too long ago. So that's pretty exciting. And it's an exclusive Owl Crate signed edition. So there's another letter from the author, so that's really neat. What do you guys normally do with these? Do you keep them inside the books or do you display them somewhere else? I'd love to know what I should do with them. So The Crier's War by Nina Varela. Varela? Um, one mortal, one maid, one loved, one betrayed. Ooh, that sounds awesome. So and let's see, just a nice simple naked cover. Look at that eh, book and no, oh, that would be pretty naked too. It matches the um, other cover. So that is really cool. And what else is in here? Okay, and then so November's box is gonna be through the enchanted forest. And it says, every November box will include an exclusive reading planner in collaboration with Blue Star Blue Star Press. 
So that is super cool. Oh, and look at the art on this. So pretty. And, oh, we got a sticker too. Everything science fiction until it, someone makes it science fact by Marie Lu. So, very cool. So let's look to see what I just didn't know was going on. Um, so, oh, the necklace. Here we go. So the necklace is from the Lunar Chronicles. It says that the magnetics from Crafted Van are inspired by their favorite comic series of all time, Saga. So I'm definitely going to have to check that out. It looks pretty cool. I know um, early on... Crafted Van was working with All Crate like way back when I started it years ago. So it's kind of school, cool to see that come around. So overall, I'm super excited with everything we got. Especially two books. That's pretty sweet. Two hardcover books. Like covers the cost of it, let alone everything else that was in there. So I think All Crate knocked it out of the park. And I'm super excited to see what other um, subscription boxes have for me next month. <laughs> it's hard to wait a month in between, isn't it? Thanks for hanging out in my living room and checking out my book mail.